I just talked to Graham so I realized how late it had gotten. I was like, are you coming or not? And she's like, well, if you're going to fixate on it, think about it, dwell on it, go crazy about it, get all nasty, thinking about why I'm not there until I do get there, then fine. I'll come in about half an hour. I was like, what the fuck is that? What is that? I didn't say any of those things. Where did you even pick that up? Because those aren't my threats. My threats are like, I'm going to fucking kill your family, you know, um, burn down your house, uh, slash your tires, um, all that kind of stuff. I don't even know what that other stuff is. So just never mind. <laughs> don't, no, don't bother. I'll take out the garbage. I'll watch some movies. I'll see you tomorrow. But I was hoping she was going to bring me my reflexology book. And um, what? There was one more, too, I asked her to bring. I can't remember what it was now, but it was super important earlier. And I really wanted that reflexology book, though. Okay, Starlight, come on. So, good night, littles and stuff. I am going to sign off because I wasn't going to do all those things. But now that she's accused me of them, I'm like, well, I'm going to dwell on that. Right. I, I, get, I uh, If you need a job of bringing somebody their stuff every day, paying for it, and um, being... Um, underappreciated for a volunteer position, call me, 443-878-9847. All I really need is someone to go pick me up smokes, alcohol every morning, toilet paper, um, feed me, like, one meal a day, um, and not expect any kind of uh, anything in return for me. But <sighs> Grams is about to get her ass fired for talking to me like that.